Good morning. Um, obviously, at this point in time, everyone's very worried about uh, high fevers, and you probably will be ringing 111 if that's the case. And that's appropriate. But of course, you have to bear in mind that healing crises um, include high fevers that may not be related to COVID. And indeed, also that you may have coughs and colds uh, where you tend to turn to medication. And for fevers and for coughs and colds, there is a very uh, proven old recipe to deal with this, which is unmedicated and highly effective. And that is the good old cold compress. What essentially one wants to do is to stimulate the waste elimination organs, in particular the uh, liver and the kidneys. And so what you would want to do is to take a strip of cotton from an old sheet, put it in very cold water, and then wring it obviously so that it's not dripping, but it's still very wet. And you will then place it around the waist, yours or the person's concerned, and then very quickly use an overlapping strip of wool from an old pullover or a purpose strip and then some safety pins and you may also and of course you're using this straight on the skin not on the t-shirt you may also want to top that up if you actually have a cough and a cold and use a smaller strip to put around the neck equally wet immediately surrounded with the wool and again with a safety pin. What you want to do as a precaution is that before you start, you want to ensure that the body is nice and hot. Put the um, cold compresses on, get back into the warmth and simply check after a few minutes under the compress that the skin is warm and not damp and cold. If the latter, then I would suggest that you take the uh, compresses off again because your body does not have the right immune um, uh, energy to deal with a cold compress. But in a large majority of cases, you'll find that the body is nice and warm and you tend to fall asleep uh, uh, very quickly afterwards. Certainly we use these cold compresses with our children and yes they mumble a bit and groan a bit when you actually put it on but you put them back into the bed into the warmth and they fall asleep uh, very very quickly and wake up the next morning refreshed and what this does in the case of a fever which theoretically is also productive for health it also a fever is is you know um, is burning through the body uh, with, with health effects um, it keeps the fever just below uh, danger levels to be productive and to uh, be part of the waste elimination process. If you have any questions about this, please email me on Matthew, M-A-T-H-I-E-U, at bridgetohealth.co.uk, uh, and I can provide responses, but this really is sharing a very uh, good old uh, 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 recipe to control fever and make it productive for the healing process, and equally to deal with uh, um, coughs and colds. I hope that's helpful for you. All the very best.